Yo, what it do, what it don't, what it is, what it is, and you already know what this is. This is once we're not saying managing dedicated shit that I'm into it's the end. I'm your host P5, aka P is for painting. And this is another episode of Nice Bit of Kit that you already know I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go around, come back and show and we're gonna do it like we're doing it for TV, so let's do it. Let's get it gang. Oh, 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 guys, I'm back in shot, I'm back in shot, you already see what it is, you see what it is, let me give you a little twirlage, twirlage, twirl, oops, other way around, twirlage, alright guys, should we get into it, let's get into it, you see my waist right there, you know what I'm saying, let's do this, alright guys, today we have a really special kind of cheeky little pace, cheeky little pace shall we say, I've got this CP company jacket, from the 80s. The 80s, I say, yes. Some of you think that the 80s is just a movie. No, it was actually a decade that some of us were alive in. All right, guys, should we get into it? Let's get into it. So, like I said, we have the CP Company um, piece from the 80s. I would like to say I forgot because I'm so excited. This is a CP Company under 16. So for those of you who don't know, CP Company do an under 16 range, um, and that under 16 range is, is basically for the kids. But back in the days, because the sizes were so much bigger, like a kid's one would be a normal one for today's market. So you see a lot of the old under 16 stuff, which are um, available in adult sizes. Normally the size is fine, as in the P2P, but you might find that there's a shortage and in, a shortening of the old armage. So there are some sort of um, give and takes for it. But yeah, the CP under 16 range, really good. And especially if you can find older pieces because they will be in modern day adult sizes, if that makes sense. All right, guys, there's a little brief histoire and let's get into it. So guys, as you can see, say my waist. <laughs> this is my waist. <laughs> waist me knee, that's my waist, okay? So that's my waist. Now, as you can see, the jacket comes just to my waist. I'll give you a little toilet large so you can see. There's my, there's my waist right there, and the jacket comes just down. So let's do a zip up, shall we? Pardon the sniffling, guys. I've got a bit of a sniffle going on, so I do apologize. Okay, so I've zipped up, as you can see. And as you can see, you have this ribbed... Um, body and of course equilibrium same beautiful thing the ribbon on this side is equilibrium is equal to the ribbon on this side i will step back so you have this nice ribbed cotton body right there in this burgundy flavor burgundy as you can see very very nice of course you can see the um the arms are kind of in this um nylon would you say and again equilibrium same beautiful thing let me show you the cuffages as you can see left hand side right hand side equilibrium is a beautiful thing go into what i was talking about look at that there's my there's my um cuff stop and there's the wrist thank god i've got a black bit underneath so it kind of looks like a meshing but as you can see it stops here so the body p2p is perfect but the armage is very short because obviously you know if you're under 16 you might not have such a long um arms but you still might be as wide so that is why you have the discrepancy but again you can always you know wear something underneath give it a bit of a thing and you don't even notice as you can see you have left hand side right hand side you have these two zipped pockets hands down the street walk down the street if you're your skyrocket perfect positioning not the perfect width though if you put your hands in here they won't be comfortable for long because there's not much space you can't put your little apartment in here and you can't put your speedboat in here really this pocket i'd put a napkin in one and i'd put a, um, a handkerchief in the other it's not really look i put my hands in you can still see my hands see unless i sort of do that and squeeze my hands in and nobody wants to do that ain't nobody got time for that so yeah super super nice but pockets no not from one hands up shake a leg so let me just show you as you can see in there cp company right there you see the little sailor right there of course you see the cp company um i don't know if this was an asia exclusive i can't remember i got this of um brian transplant once again again he got some amazing bits um definitely check out his page once again i'll put his thing down below super super nice all right guys now i know what you're thinking okay cool it's from the 80s there's not much to it big deal well what i didn't tell you was that this my beautiful people 
is a two for. That's right. A what? A two for Van Droos. That's right. That means two for one, two for one, you get two for one. Anybody want two for one? I want two for one. Now, guys, we have the two for. Let me just zip up and we can show you what we're going to do. It's never too much, never too much. You'll get it if you get it. <laughs> All right, my beautiful people, zip up and let me come a bit closer. So we still have the same material right there. You see the material, you see the material. Now I know what you're thinking. Kiss could say, well, let me give you some detailing. Let me give you some detailing. You see that CP company, beautiful, with the green edge. Now this was the precursor to the Stone Island um, green edge, I think. I'm not going to say it was, but I feel like this came before the Stone Island had the green edge, I think. Um, there will be people who will be able to confirm that, and I'm not necessarily one of them. But as you can see, very rare CP company with the green edge. And of course, for those of you who don't know, Massimo Osti started both brands, Stone Island and CP company. So they were brother and sister, still are, but now they're a bit more fractured, so to speak. They are entities of their own. But in the initial days, you know, things pass through and you know um, ideas for one that weren't good enough for other might have been good enough for the other you know what I'm saying anyway look at that once again green edge badge now the eagle eye amongst you might have thought kiss could say on your right arm is that a bit moody is that a bit moody have a look gang you see what it says CP company right there now the under 16 CP companies some of them came with this badge right here and it's beautiful it's my first um, under 16 piece with the badge so yeah super nice as you can see the super um, the CP company once again a precursor for the old um, stone of Ireland badge of course you've got the buttons right there and the eagle eye amongst you would have noticed that on the other side it also has the button so that you can put the CP company badge super Super dope guys, I'll just give you a turn around. There's nothing much really to see. It's really a plain nylon, but I love things like this. That little green CP, um, you know, not ver not seen very often um, outline badge. Had to have it, super dope, super nice. Of course, you've got the nice black and white badge. Um, super nice, super nice. Um, I'll give you a bit more detail on this CP um, company under 16 badge in a different video. But guys, that was the two for one two for Vandros and this has been just a super super dope um, reversible CP company from the 80s um, bomber jacket shall we say maybe a bomber jacket no I'd call it a track jacket shall we say guys super nice piece glad to have it in the collection um, let me know your thoughts let me know what you're thinking let me know how you're doing and as always guys leave your comments down below guys I appreciate you more than you guys would know. Stay dope, stay fly. This has been another episode of a nice bit of kit that I've been your host, P Fire, aka P equals MC Squared. And this has been once. We're not saying magazine dedicated to shit that I'm into. It's the end, guys. Stay dope, stay fly. Leave your comments down below. Share, like, and hit me up. Guys, I'm going to see you on the flip side. Mad love. Peace.